Hey guys, it's Megan. Um, I kind of wanted to do a quick video um, about shellac. Basically, I know I've done other videos in the past where I've shown you guys how to use it, different colors or whatever, but now I'm here to kind of review it um, with something that I found out this weekend. So, me and my husband went on vacation. We went and stayed at NBC Suites and they have an indoor heated pool. So we went swimming. Well, the day before we left, I put shellac on my nails. I think I did tutti frutti, I wanna say. And what happened was kind of interesting. So I did both hands, of course. And so I'm in the middle of the swimming and my shellac on one hand just starts to like peel off. And so I come home, and this is what I have left. So I have one hand that still has it pretty much on there. One hand, it's all gone. So I kind of felt really silly on vacation with one hand done and one hand not. So buyers beware that if you are going to be swimming a lot, I'm not sure if shellac, I mean, if you like to get them done every time after you swim and you have that kind of money that's great but if you're gonna be swimming a lot this summer then shellac might not be the way to go because I mean I love shellac and I love the way it makes you look it doesn't damage your nails but at the same time if you're gonna be swimming it's kind of a waste of money to just have it fall off I mean I did them the same day one day before we went swimming I did them myself, and this is what I came home with. So, just wanted to let you guys know, and uh, if you have any questions, let me know. I mean, it may have just been how high their chlorine was in the public pool. I'm not really sure. Maybe I'll test it out again and let you guys know if I had the same effect in a different pool. But um, I just wanted to let you guys know that's a review that I found. So if you have any questions, just let me know, and I'll try to answer them. And um, anything else, just let me know. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.